ever wondered about the beating heart beneath the gleaming body of a car? This isn't just a story of modern metal and circuits, it's a chronicle of centuries-old innovation. Today, we're journeying through the world of electric vehicle propulsion and delving into a 200-year-old tech that promises a turbocharged future. Buckle up, because at Ignition Life, we're accelerating from history to future tech in zero to 60. Echoing through the annals of automotive innovation, this might sound like the tech of tomorrow, but its roots trace back to the 19th century. Michael Faraday, often hailed as the father of electromagnetism, crafted the first ever electrical generator using the axial flux principle. But like a classic car tucked away in the garage, it wasn't time for its spotlight yet. Let's turn on the ignition on some facts. The automotive world has largely been powered by radial flux motors. Their structure is like a scenic winding road, functional and reliable. However, axial flux motors are like the high-speed autobahn of electromagnetic propulsion. They direct their magnetic flux parallel to the rotation's axis, which translates to efficiency, power, and torque. So how do these dynamos sprint with electric energy? On the electromagnetic playground, coils and permanent magnets are engaged in a mesmerizing dance of attraction and repulsion. A charged coil beckons the rotor, initiating movement. But this isn't a one-off. The momentum continues, coil after coil, creating a ballet of continuous rotation. Poetry, physics, and power all in one. Historically, the story of axial flux motors is an intricate web of innovation, overshadowed for a long period by its radial flux counterpart. Nikola Tesla, renowned for his unparalleled contributions to the world of electricity and magnetism, envisioned the possibilities of axial flux as early as 1889. His designs and patents showcased an intuitive understanding of electromagnetic fields and their potential in axial configuration. Though Tesla's experiments often revolved around a myriad of electrical designs, his forays into axial flux were precursors to a transformative automotive shift. However, despite Tesla's vision, the late 19th and early 20th centuries witnessed the dominance of radial flux motors. The reason was manifold. These motors were simpler in design, easier to manufacture, and had established themselves as reliable options for many industries. Furthermore, the technological landscape of the era, with limited resources and less advanced manufacturing techniques, favored the established and proven radial design. But Tesla wasn't the only name associated with the axial flux narrative. Michael Faraday, who was instrumental in laying the groundwork for electromagnetic principles, had also hinted at the axial flux concept through his pioneering experiments in the 1830s. While Faraday's primary focus was not on motor design, his exploration into the realm of electromagnetism provided foundational knowledge. As the 20th century progressed, various inventors and engineers dabbled with the axial flux design, but it remained largely in the academic and experimental domain. It took the renowned interest in electric vehicles in the late 20th and early 21st centuries for axial flux motors to find their vocation. As the world began to shift towards sustainable transportation, the inherent advantages of axial flux motors, efficiency, compactness, and torque became increasingly significant. The challenge of achieving greater distances on a single battery charge made these motors an attractive proposition. And thus, the motor that had remained in the shadows for over a century started its mighty comeback, revving up to redefine the future of mobility. Consider these figures. Axial flux motors, due to their innovative structure, can promise up to 30 to 40% more torque than their radial counterparts. More torque means more immediate power and responsiveness, a factor crucial in situations like aircraft takeoffs or that adrenaline-fueled sprint in a supercar. Furthermore, with better cooling and compact design, they offer longer lifespans and integrate seamlessly into modern vehicle designs. The acquisition of Yassa by Mercedes wasn't just another corporate buyout in the automotive landscape. It was a statement, a clear indication that Mercedes was making a strategic shift 
towards the future of motoring, a future driven by electric power. But why Yasa? Yasa, an Oxford-based company, had carved out a reputation for itself in the niche world of axial flux motors. Their innovative approach to motor design, combined with the ability to maintain performance levels under high demand, made them a compelling partner for automotive giants like Mercedes. The alignment between Mercedes and Yasa isn't just strategic, it's also symbolic. Mercedes, a brand that has been emblematic of luxury and performance for over a century, was keen to ensure that its transition to electric doesn't compromise the brand's DNA. In Yasa, Mercedes saw a partner that could provide a motor which combined efficiency with the brute power Mercedes AMG division is renowned for. Chris Harris, an auto journalist, once remarked, Mercedes AMG isn't just about going fast, it's about feeling every heartbeat, every rev, and every pulse of power. The acquisition of Yasa was about ensuring this ethos remains intact in the electric era. With this acquisition, Mercedes wasn't just buying a company, they were investing in a vision. A vision of electric AMG models roaring with the same intensity and fervor as their internal combustion counterparts. Given AMG's high performance reputation, having a motor like Yasa's Axial Flux was a critical component to ensuring that Mercedes' electric future matched, if not surpassed, its storied past. The move also emphasized Mercedes' commitment to bringing core technologies in-house. By doing so, they ensure that the unique character and performance of their vehicles remain undiluted. Mercedes understands that in the electric age, differentiation won't come from the roar of an engine, but from the underlying technology that propels the car forward. In a conversation at the Geneva Motor Show, Ola Schlenius, chairman of the board of management of Daimler AG and Mercedes-Benz AG said, innovation isn't just about embracing change, it's about driving it. With Yasa under our wings, we aim to redefine what it means to be a high-performance electric vehicle. In essence, the acquisition of Yasa wasn't just about obtaining cutting-edge technology. It was about Mercedes preparing itself for the challenges of tomorrow, ensuring that the three-pointed star remains at the pinnacle of automotive excellence. McLaren, a name that has become synonymous with automotive excellence, has consistently been at the forefront of automotive innovation. Their journey has always been about pushing the boundaries, seeking perfection where others see completion. When they embarked on the ambitious project of creating the Artura, the stakes were high. It was more than just another vehicle, it was a statement of intent, a vision of the future. The Artura was McLaren's bold step into the realm of electric vehicles, a market burgeoning with possibilities but fraught with challenges. To stay true to their brand's essence, that intoxicating fusion of raw power and elegant performance, McLaren needed a powertrain that would echo the iconic roar of their legendary models, albeit with an electric twist. Enter the Axial Flux electric motor. The choice wasn't just a whim. Axial Flux motors, with their compact design and high torque to weight ratio, provided an edge in performance that radial counterparts often couldn't match. But McLaren didn't just settle for any Axial Flux motor, they sought one that would deliver a staggering 94 horsepower, all while weighing in at 34 pounds. This meant that even in the silent world of electric vehicles, the Artura could make its presence felt not just by its speed, but by the sheer power it exuded. McLaren's commitment to this technology is a testament to its potential. Where many saw electric vehicles as quiet, environment-friendly alternatives, McLaren envisioned a beast that roared, both in sound and performance. By opting for the Axial Flux motor, they were able to harness the efficiency inherent in electric propulsion while preserving the adrenaline-pumping experience that has always been the hallmark of their brand. In essence, the Artura is more than just a car. It's a manifestation of McLaren's relentless pursuit of excellence. Through their embrace of Axial Flux technology, they have showcased not just the future of their brand, but the potential future of the automotive industry, a world where power and sustainability coexist in perfect harmony. The aviation industry, too, is spreading its wings with this technology. Rolls-Royce's Ion Bird, 
with three Yasa Axial Flux motors, can store the energy equivalent of 6,000 lithium-ion batteries, boasting a groundbreaking efficiency exceeding 96%. That's not just evolutionary, it's revolutionary. Now, a glimpse into the future. As urbanization intensifies, there's a rising clamor for compact, efficient vehicles, especially in congested cityscapes. Axial flux motors, with their high power density and smaller footprint, are primed to dominate this space. Think of city cars, two-wheelers, drones, and even electric skateboards. The possibilities are electrifying. Moreover, with global pushes towards sustainability and reduced carbon footprints, the efficiency offered by axial flux motors means less energy wastage, translating to extended battery lives and ranges for electric vehicles. As renewable energy sources become more prevalent, integrating them with axial flux tech could redefine our transportation grids. The Horizon also brings forward transverse flux motors, evolving the game further. Their unique stator winding design, flowing the magnetic flux in three mesmerizing dimensions, amplifies torque, power, and efficiency. They're not just the motors of tomorrow, they're the motors of a sustainable, powerful, and efficient future. Asphalt, air, or the next frontier, the future is electric and pulsating with the echoes of axial and transverse tech. From the historic alleys of Faraday and Tesla to the futuristic avenues of McLaren, Mercedes, and Rolls-Royce, it's a journey of relentless innovation. Keep the spark alive, stay curious, and ensure your pit stops include ignition life for insights into the world of vehicular wonders.